The Miami Hurricanes football team is making national headlines for their play on the field. One player is becoming a star locally for his efforts in the community. Defensive end Demetrius Jackson was in Overtown today giving out Thanksgiving turkeys. Here's CBS 4's Mike Cunha. Demetrius Jackson's football season may have been cut short because of an injury, but the season of giving is just getting started. I want to do something nice for the community, you know, for yeah, my people. So I want, we donated, they helped me, we donated, we donated 15 turkeys. More than a dozen turkeys were handed out at Phyllis Wheatley Elementary, but Jackson says through other donations, his foundation Young Men of Tomorrow will feed around 70 families in South Florida. Oh uh, yeah, the canned goods, they come, they in-house. They come from um, track and field. Yeah. And I believe some other some other sports groups, but I know track and field, they donated the most. On hand were some of the Canes' fiercest tacklers who ditched their shoulder pads to lend a helping hand. He being a blessing to some people who, you know, I wouldn't say less fortunate, but, you know, he's he making a Thanksgiving a lot easier. It was actually a great idea and a way to, you know what I'm saying, just get a, use this platform to help others. This stop at Phyllis Wheatley was special for Jackson, who used to walk these very halls. No matter how far you go in life, just coming back and contributing is part of what we expect for you to do and what we would need for you to do. For now, he's working on feeding families, but in the future, he wants to tackle even bigger issues. You know, this is my home. You know, when a lot of people talk about over town. They speak about the negative things, the bad things, but you don't see the good. They don't talk about the good things that you know that comes that comes out of here. You know, they don't speak about the. Uh, the Treon Harris, they don't speak about the coat, the ISIS. They don't speak about these guys right here. These are the mentors behind the scenes. And this place has a, has a lot of history. It just overshadowed the violence, you know, the corruption and the crime. You know, fans are, are cheering for this guy yeah. on Saturdays, but when he said, but you may be voting for him one day. He says when his playing days are over, he wants to run for office. Absolutely. One day, maybe even be governor of the state of Florida. Fantastic. So he's got lofty goals and he wants to make real change. And of course, it's nice to see him starting with the community. That and he lives so many in. of these hurricane players are yep. local kids. That's right. And it's great to see them get And even back. the ones that aren't local have told us uh, out in the practice field that he takes them to their neighborhoods to see where he grew up. That way they can also be a factor of change. Right. Thanks. Yeah.